Hey everyone, um, I just wanted to kind of come to you today with the little video on the topic of excuses. Um, excuses just so happens to be one of my pet peeves, um, but it will definitely kill your business. So, um, you know, everybody joined this business for a reason, whether it was to make an extra $500 a month to, you know, make ends meet, or whether you are buried in debt and you're struggling and you really just want to change your financial future. Everybody has a different reason. <coughs> Excuse me. So, you know, whatever that reason was made you join this company to change it. So, you know, I hear so many people after they join saying they're having a hard time getting people, you know, getting people. Um, that's a word I hear a lot. Um, you know, they're having a hard time. They're not sure what to do. How come Instagram isn't working for them? Um, I'm, I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing. You know, and I'll instantly say to them, are you posting six to eight photos a day on Instagram with one before and after? Are you building relationships? Are you following people? Are you unfollowing people? Are you reaching out? Are you doing your hundreds list? You know, there's so many things that go into it. So if you're not doing what we are training you to do, then you can't expect this business to work for you. It's not something that's just going to fall in your lap. And I think a lot of people that join tend to think that it is going to just fall in their lap. I mean that this requires hard work so whatever you need to do to get it done you're gonna to have to do it um, you know I hear so many people say I don't have the time I can't do this I work a 40-hour work week you know I don't have time to post which is crazy to me um, you know everybody has the same 24 hours in a day so it's what you do with those 24 hours that make it count you know, I have two people on my team that both work full-time jobs and do on top of it works and they both promoted to Double Diamond last month. So those are the kind of people that don't let their excuses control them. You need to be, if you want to get to the top, you need to be able to not have excuses. Those people at the top are the ones that were able to push those excuses aside and just run. You need to put your blinders on and you need to just run. Um, you know, if people, if you're posting on Instagram and Facebook and you and you are doing what you're supposed to be doing and you're doing what we're training You know, maybe that's not your thing. Maybe you know, you need to start blitzing or Doing more parties or doing more stuff in person, you know, you need to be able to find your niche so If it's not working you need to switch it up to find something that's going to work for you rather than make an excuse on why your business isn't working um, So yeah, I think that's pretty much it guys, but you know, excuses are, I had a little list here, <laughs> sorry. Um, excuses are one of the things that drive me crazy because, you know, everybody has something going on in their life. Everybody has a struggle. You know, I have struggles on a daily basis that you would never know because I don't complain about it on Facebook. You know, I don't let it get in my way of what I'm trying to do for my family. And you can choose to fight through those struggles that you have, or you can choose to make excuses and, you know, not work this business because of those excuses. So this, this is in your hands. You are the only one that can control your outcome of this business. So rather than making excuses on why it's not working, you need to figure out what you're doing wrong and you need to switch it up. So if you need advice or if you need, you know, if you need somebody to check out your Instagram or check out your Facebook, reach out to your upline, you know? I'm always willing to do that for my team and see, you know, if they are, if they could like switch something up to make it a little bit better than it was. So, you know, don't let the excuses control your business. This is your business. You can do this if you push those excuses aside. Um, so if you have any questions or anything, you know, I'm, I'm always here, um, but definitely reach out to your upline and, and have them help you if things aren't working instead of making an excuse on why they're not working. Okay, thank you.